1974. Her work with Hammer Film Productions elevated her cult figure status. She starred as Camilla Merkella in The Vampire Lovers, based on Joseph Shredian, Lee Fanu's novella Carmilla, and played the title role in Countess Dracula, based on the legends about Countess Elizabeth Bathory. Pitt also appeared in the Amicus horror anthology film The House That Dripped Blood, and had a small part in The Wicker Man. In the mid-1970s, she appeared in the judging panel of the British ITV talent show New Faces. During the 1980s, Pitt returned to mainstream films and television, a role as Fraulein Baum in the 1981 BBC Playhouse Unity, who is denounced as a Jew by Unity Midford, was comfortably close to her real-life experiences. Her popularity with horror film buffs had her in demand for guest appearances at horror conventions and film festivals. And other films in which Pitt has appeared outside the horror genre are Who Dares Win, Wild Geese 2, and Hannah's War. Generally cast as a villainess, her characters often died horribly at the end of the final reel. Being the anti-hero is great, there are always rules you can get your teeth into. At this time, the theater also beckoned. Pitt found her own theatrical touring company and started successful productions of Dial M for Murder, Duty Free, or Don't Bother to Dress, and Woman of Straw. She also appeared in many TV shows in the United Kingdom and the U.S., among them Ironside, Dundee, and The Colhane and Smiley's People. In 1998, Pitt narrated Cradle of Filth's Cruelty and the Beast album, although her narration was done strictly in character as a Countess Elizabeth Bathory as she portrayed in Countess Dracula. In 2000, Pitt made her return to the big screen in The Asylum, starring Colin Baker and Patrick Moore, and directed by John Stewart. In 2003, Pitt voiced the role of Lady Violator in Ringa Media's production Dominator. The film was the UK's first computer-generated imagery animated film. After a period of illness, it returned to the screen in 2006 for the Hammer Films' Mario Bava tribute, Sea of Dust. Ingrid will also have a writing career. Pitt's original novel, Dracula, was released in limited edition by Avalard in October 2012 alongside the script for unproduced film version Dracula Who and Return of Countess Dracula. Roe Ingrid had played on screen for Hammer Films. Pitt married three times, Laud Roland Pitt Jr., an American GI, George Pinch is a British film executive, and Tony Rudlin, a rider and racing car driver. Her daughter from her first marriage, Stephanie Pitt Blake, is also an actress. She has a passion for World War II aircraft. After revealing this on a radio program, she was invited by the museum at RAF Duxford to have a flight in a Lancaster bomber. She held a student pilot license and a black belt in karate. She died in South London Hospital on 23rd of November of 2010, a few days after collapsing, and two days after her 73rd birthday from congestive heart failure. And many people will know her as the Countess, but uh, will be known also as one of the first screen queens. Thank you guys for watching the Bee Cyclopedia. Comment below if you would like to hear about more Bee Cyclopedia stars. Who's your daddy?